It's a blustery fall day in North Liberty, and visitors to the Colony Pumpkin Patch can explore a new, expanded attraction after they've picked their pumpkins this year. This is the second time we've done the corn maze. Uh, last year we did the corn maze just to, as a trial run to see if people would enjoy it, if they'd like it or not, just to see how it goes. Uh, this year with the North Liberty Centennial, we thought we'd really incorporate the, the corn maze into what North Liberty has going on uh, for the year. It says North Liberty on it, and it says the year from 1913 to 2013. The colonies have expanded their corn maze this year to five acres to commemorate the centennial anniversary of North Liberty's founding. And they've also extended the hours into the evenings on Fridays and Saturdays for those who want to bring a flashlight and explore the maze in dark. Now be sure to bring a smartphone also so you can navigate your way out if you get lost. Oh yeah, yeah, there's been a couple of people got lost out there. There's a emergency contact phone number on the, uh, the paper that we give them. It, uh, the, the paper we give them gives them kind of directions or gives them an, an idea on where to go. Uh, and where they might be at, possibly. Um, we didn't want to do a haunted maze just because there's so many young people in North Liberty. So we thought just a night, night maze in itself would be spooky enough for some people. Despite the accommodations for young visitors, Colony said the maze has been drawing diverse crowds of all shapes and sizes since the patch opened on September 28th. From Colony Pumpkin Patch, Matt Starnes, DITV.